Good morning, everybody. I, uh, am, I'm laughing because uh, the last few days I've come to you and I look back on those videos and I look totally sweaty. So now today is called Sarah's Saturday Sweaty Word of the Day. Just got done with Insanity. I just finished my third week. It is a uh, actually a nine week program you do the first week for the or the first month um, is phase one and then you get a week of recovery which is an awesome workout and then you go into the month two and it is awesome it's my favorite thing and it is hi Amber hi Christine Christy hi Shadar good morning sweetheart how's Florida uh, anyway I'm on a high again because I just finished insanity like I said I'm done with the third week and it feels amazing and I was thinking today, I think a lot when, I, when I'm working out, I literally, I literally plan my whole day and, and all that, it just happens, I just go through the motions and it's like I'm not even working out because I'm planning my day. But I was thinking that when I do these programs, I do them exactly how they're laid out and it's just like my life. It's, I do a fitness program and exactly how I run my business, how I run my businesses and how I run my life and it's really, really cool. It's that small, thank you, Christy. It's those small, consistent, hi, Colleen. Those small, consistent steps in my life that I do. And I have learned this through my personal development. And today, during my personal development, I read the coolest quote, listen to this. Um, Reading is to the mind, what exercise is to the body, and prayer is to the soul. We become the books we read. Matthew Kelly said that. That is so cool because I never knew anything about personal development until I started this business and it has completely changed my life. And am I saying you gotta go buy 17 books and read them all at the same time? Absolutely not. The key to living through your personal development is reading 10 pages a day. Everybody in the whole wide world can read 10 pages a day. You can do it. And do you know what? When you do that, that means you've read 3,650 pages in a year. That is 18 personal development books. 18 personal development books. Can you imagine how much you would change if you read 18 personal development books? You become the books you read. And did you also know that you have access to people's knowledge in every single area of your life? This is so cool because if you want to work on your marriage, there are so many self-help books on marriage and it can help and change your entire life. Uh, some, of the, some of them are the five love languages, the soulmate experience, and the seven principles for making a marriage work. Cool. All of us that are in relationships know there are ups and downs and when we focus on the positives in our relationships, then we make them better instead of focusing on the negative icky parts and all the things that we think bug us, focus on the things that you love. But anyway, you guys, if I can get one word out today, it is this. Personal development and reading will change your life in all areas. You will change, you will become and grow into a completely different person. Life, hi Robin, hi Susan. Life is about, uh, it's not a destination, but it is a journey. And why not make this journey we all, I miss you too, Christy. Why can't we make this journey of life the best that it can possibly, possibly be? We are, we are on this amazing spinning out of control earth and we never know what's gonna happen yet. So why not live every single day the best way we possibly can? Every single day is such a huge, gigantic, gift for us and we can make it better. You know how? Because we work on ourselves and then we overflow with excitement and love for everybody else and serve all of them. So thanks for joining me today. It's Saturday. I'm pumped up. I got my workout in. I'm hitting the shower right now and then I get to go watch my baby play basketball and I'm super excited about that and I hope that every single one of you chooses to make this day the most amazing day ever and I will see you tomorrow. Hi Celeste. Hi, bye. <laughs> yes, you have a beautiful weekend too, Christy. By the way, you look amazing. Your body is rock star. Wow. <laughs> it's like goals, goals, goals. Bye guys. <laughs>